For this recipe you will need about a pound of apples, any apples you like, sweet ones or uh, or even uh, Granny Smith will be working here. It gives very very interesting and non-sweet edge to it. Lemon or lime, I'm using lime today, a little bit of ginger, cinnamon, half cup of fl all-purpose flour and sugar. And for the frying I will need some kind of oil. I'm using coconut oil, extra virgin organic coconut oil. You can use uh, gra uh, grapeseed oil or any oil you like. Hi everyone, welcome to Easy Recipes with Twist.com. My name is Victoria Pikin and today I'm here with my friends at RecipeLion.com who asked me to produce a video on those amazing and beautiful apple fritters loaded with ginger and cinnamon. Amazing, easy to make, I hope you will enjoy and stay tuned. Take your food processor and um, core the apples and uh, chop them this way that they will fit to the food processor, not more. Add also, add half or lemon juice It's in order to keep them bright and not go uh, brown. Otherwise your uh, fritters will be absolutely brownish color. And bleed them finely. Transfer the apples to large bowl. it still goes brown because we chopped it but it won't uh, go as brown as if you want add uh, lime when the all apples are uh, processed and um, done add the eggs in one two and three. Add sugar. The amount of sugar it depends only up to you. If you like very sweet, add three tablespoons or even four. If you like it's moderate, like me, I'm adding only two tablespoons of sugar in and flour. And mix it all together well. And that's it. I think afterwards we can fry it. Ah, yes, of course. I forgot to add cinnamon. You can't have apples without cinnamon. And I won't going to have apple without cinnamon. So, cinnamon goes in. About half a teaspoon or so. Mm, it looks really good. Preheat skillet to medium-high heat, add about a tablespoon of oil. I love the flavor and the texture of this coconut oil. It's pretty amazing. And you know that this is brain food. This oil goes and feeds your brain. And it's very important to consume, especially in the morning. You will feel much more alert with this oil. Okay, the oil is hot and now let's start, start frying them. I like them fairly small because they are so packed with flavor and they are so amazing so I'm trying to make them pretty small but you can make them large, you can make them any size or shape you like. About one tablespoon worth of uh, butter. You see, when the bubbles like here started to appear on this side, you can flip it. It will take about a minute or so on one side and another minute or so on the other side. And the house now smells 
like true apple pie smell. You have no idea how good it is. Nice. I think they are done from both both sides, so I can easily take them out. And that's it. Prepare to eat. I think this needs another minute or so. Let's add a little bit of icing sugar, just for the sake of the beauty and cinnamon and mm, it looks really pretty and serve let's try our creation mm, mm, mm. one of the best things I ever ate you know you can get wrong with apples and cinnamon and ginger. It's really good. I hope you will give it a go. And you know the usual drill. Don't forget to subscribe, like me, comment, thumbs up me and cheers, Victoria.